And today, we are on the campus of Eastern Michigan University. Give, give it a little shot, see them where we are. It's gorgeous. Look at this weather. It's beautiful out. Anyways, the director of our show has invited me, all the way from Scotland, to come check out this lake. As you can see, the lake, show them the lake. It is rumored that in this lake lives a monster. And because of my Scottish background of tracking the Loch Ness for my entire life, the director of the show believes that I will be able to discover the true identity of the creature in this lake. I'm gonna go around and ask a few people on campus if they have any idea about this creature to get a little information about it. Follow me. Excuse me, can I borrow you for a second? Hi, how's it going? Good, how are you? Good, you're in the Nature Ganza. Hello. I'm all the way from Scotland here. Investigating, you are familiar with this lake? Sure. All right. Um, through what I've been told that there is a monster living in this lake. Sure is. And would you, could you describe it to me? It's like, it's like big and it has like gnarly teeth and it goes raw. It's, it's a good description, big, gnarly and goes raw. Yeah. All right, thank you very much. You're welcome. Have a good day. Bye. So, what we've got so far is just a big clitter. It's a big clitter with gnarly teeth and it goes raw. Yes, very dangerous. Very dangerous. It's a good sign that there's a monster in a way if the geese are flying away. Geese are some of the most deadly clitters on the planet. True story. There's some people over there on those rocks. They're close, they must know what's in there. Let's go check in there. This sign is a warning to anyone who tries to come near the lake. It's extremely dangerous. There's no swimming, diving, fishing, boating, or skating for the sole reason that that monster has been known to kill at least 17 people a year. All right, there's some very brave people over here, like I mentioned before, and they're still there. We're gonna go check them out. Now, one of the great ways to know if a monster is truly in a lake is this thicket area right here. This is a great place for other critters that it would eat to come down and, you know, gather some food and stuff. You probably get some squares, some muskrats, things like that. That's one of the really nice things about this section here. And it's, it, this part is ripped up, not ripped up, body of land off from this other section of water, where it is much, much calmer and shallower. This is the deep end where the monster is supposed to live. Hello. Hi. 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 Oh, thanks. Are you from around here? Is this a regular spot for you to be? No. No. You've no. never been here before? No, we have, but we're, we just stay inside. Oh, I stay inside too. Um, I'm going around looking for the monster that lives in this lake. Okay. Uh, I've been called all the way from Scotland to investigate because of my work with um, the Loch Ness. It's not a monster, it's a very gentle creature. Um, there's danger signs posted around the lake. Do you know anything about must have been the lake. I haven't heard anything. Well, I've been, I've been told, from what I've been told, it's it's very large, it has gnarly teeth, and it goes rough. Oh, so, sounds scary. It does, it sounds horrible. <laughs> so I just let you to keep, to keep a look out for it. Hello. They don't know about it just. So this is probably a safe distance from what I've studied with the lock monster. Like getting down on those ropes is probably not the best idea. Okay, okay. I'll take care of that. It's good in here. I mean, uh, stay good. Alright. Watch the show. Watch the show. Okay. <laughs> There's no one else here. Everyone's gone. Alright. So what we've learned today is that there is indeed a monster in the lake. Definitive proof. It's scaring everybody around. It's big. It's got gnarly teeth. And it's uh goes raw. So if you're in University Lake, I'm calling it that from now in University Lake. We'll call it the University Lake. <laughs> Critter, because we don't know if it's a monster yet. It's a critter for right now. <laughs> stay clear, stay in the cement, stay off the grass, stay out of the thickets, and uh, ultimately keep yourself alive. Join me next time on Nature Ganza when I do something more exciting. You never know what's going to happen. I could go chase down some skateboarders, I could go do anything I want. Why? Because I'm not from this country and your rules don't apply to me. You and off.